Amazing. Um, I think I'm going to pass it off to Advika and Anvita, um, who are going to be presenting the awards. I know this is long awaited after a long summit, um, but I'm super excited that you all stuck around to really hear about um, what all the speakers have to say and really like invest in the educational side of this artificial intelligence summit. So without further ado, Advika and Anvita, are you ready? Yeah. So our first category is AI. So the first award is the All Girls Award, and our winner is Ashroya Vedula for Stock Buddy Using AI to Teach Financial Literacy to Students. Our next category is the Best Pitch, which goes to OnTrack Technologies, a team composed of Meha Paredi, Harrison Zhang, and Buri Tankajalam um, for OnTrack, using AI to reduce online distractions. Our third place award goes to um, the Dreamcatcher Lab of, of Minsu Kim and Ho Joon Yoon using music therapy and sleep, sleep analysis for insomnia treatment. And the runner up goes to Siddharth Kinney for Nomorbot, an AI based autonomous weed detecting robot. And finally, the first place award goes to Sparrow, um, composed of Ashley Ragosa, Rimsha Aman, and Shivan Garg. Um, an early diagnostic system for major depressive disorder using AI. Congratulations. Our next category is healthcare. Yeah, um, so the award for best all girl submission in the healthcare category goes to Samantha Singh, who worked on non-invasive breast cancer detection. Congratulations, Samantha. The team with the best pitch in the healthcare category was the Alleviate team composed of Anna Ducrecia and Stephanie Shang. They worked on automatic medication scheduling. Great job to Anna and Stephanie. And now for the top three places. In third place, we have Team ONCR made up of Raven Nerjar and Malison Thaboon. They worked on an optic neuron chip regenerator, which is a chip for regaining loss of vision using AI. In second place, we have Dimple Amita Garuda Puri. She worked on NAI Derm, a mobile application to diagnose, provide therapy, and connect people afflicted with skin conditions. And first place in the healthcare category goes to Divik Patel and Karen Kirthi. Their winning submission was on a wearable sensor to assist visually impaired individuals with navigation. I'd like to congratulate all of the people whose names I just announced, your hard work and passion for CS, particularly in the healthcare category was definitely apparent in your submission. All right, our next category is the mobile app development. So our All Girls Award goes to Nicole Artuno for an AI-based soccer auto tuning Trading app, good job. Uh, the, the best pitch goes to Time Tech, made of Tanvi Jamula, Sarah Nagini, for um, a personalized and smart agenda system for students. Congratulations. Our third place award goes to Dia Somnali for Bookscapes, a book club app for children and young adults with AI powered suggestions. And our runner up award is for Jaya Koluri for giveaway and AI powered matching of buyers and sellers with similar charitable interests. And finally, our first place award goes to Nitya Agari for Doekeeper, a leveraging AI expense tracking to help teams develop financial literacy. Amazing job, everyone. And our next category is free choice. The best all girls submission in the free choice category goes to Asmita and Sampruti for Rescue Truck, an app and website to connect people working to collect, receive, and donate supplies. Congratulations. The best free choice pitch was that of Atifa Mohammed, who worked on Soltech, adaptive temperature regulating shoes. Great job, Atifa. I will now be announcing the top three places in this category. In third place, we have Bavia Linga for her social media app service for the detection of suspicious activity. In second place is Om Mahadik for CyberProtect, protecting passwords and private information through artificial intelligence. And now for the very last um, award of the day, 
In first place for the free choice category goes to Yati Kapoor, who worked on a computer program for personalized drug treatments and therapy for patients through big data and cloud computation. Congratulations to all the winners. Uh, everyone did absolutely amazing. And I would just like to say that if either I or Advika announced your name today, make sure to look out for an email from Girls Computing League about award distribution. Okay, so now I'm going to be handing it over to Nivi for closing remarks. Nivi? Oh, I think her, there might be an issue with her audio. Um, okay, so. Can you hear me now? Yes, yeah, that works, yep. Awesome, all right, sorry about that. So uh, congratulations to all the winners. Uh, there's a few more things left before the end of the event. And uh, the first is the post-event survey. Um, if you haven't already completed that, uh, we'll be sending out an email um, with that link. So please fill that out when you have the chance. And uh, so this year, um, as Kavi mentioned earlier, we've expanded through our chapter programs and our chapter leaders. And with that, we've, we've been able to reach more people and uh, have more events. So if you mark down that you're interested in being a chapter leader uh, in the registration form, uh, we'll be sending uh, out an email um, in the near future. So uh, keep an eye out for that. And uh, related to the, um, uh, to the chapter program, we also have the uh, 1,000 Schools Project, uh, which is a project that aims to partner with 1,000 low income uh, centers by the end of 2021 um, to uh, promote computer science education in the places where they face budget cuts and um, to computer science education. So having these chapters um, you know, around the country really helps us reach out to more people and um, complete the goal of reaching out to a thousand places. So uh, this is a really incredible opportunity for, um, uh, for students to be part of a fast growing project uh, that will have a tangible impact on, on future generations of computer scientists. So yeah, uh, thank you everyone for making the summit happen, especially our workshop leaders, panelists, and keynote speakers. I'm sure that a lot of the students today were inspired by their work and uh, the knowledge that they've shared with us today. Um, you know, all the projects were really outstanding um, and we hope that you all continue to bring your innovation to the fields of AI and beyond. Uh, so yeah, we hope you had a great time and I look forward to seeing you at future events. Thank you so much for coming. <laughs>